Yeah, I still get I, people. I'm not getting on my soapbox because I was I work oh, for no. the, I work for the Vishla Rescue Center, so I kind of get on my soapbox. But I wish we could like handpick every Vishla owner, like so, someone like you who can get them out. And... Well, I regret telling my breeder that I run marathons and triathlons because <laughs> they gave me the alpha of a litter of seven. Oh. And I kind of like, I mean, he's great. Don't get me wrong, yeah. but like, he'll be fine when I can run him at two years old. Yeah. Um, yeah. But right now, I just, you know, it's. Oh, it'll be yeah. He'll it's be. tough to get out what he needs to get out without like overdoing it. Yeah, like cause you still got to get your run in. Right. Yeah. And you got to yeah. Yeah. So like my long run days are very very long days. Yeah. Well, it'll be a great companion in in about year. six months or so. Yeah. Yeah. Year. yeah. And I was planning on getting two, but I think he's killed that for me. I don't, know, <laughs> I don't know if I can go through this again. Yeah. Maybe I'll rescue one that's older or something. Yeah, maybe a two or three year old that can run. Yeah. They're, yeah, they're just great. They're just great. Family dogs, like loyal dogs. They're just great. It's a great breed, I think. Lots of energy, though. <laughs> Want some more? <laughs> what breeder did you get him from? Um, I got him from a guy in Idaho. Oh, okay. Uh, Steve Jarvis. Jarvis yeah. He's been doing it for like 40, 50 years. Yeah, I don't, I don't know uh, the name. I know there's a good breeder out of Idaho, but I, I did, I've never known. Oh, he's the name. great. Like I did, I was looking for like a, over a year and a half and uh, found this guy. Everybody in like the Seattle area was very sketchy for, for me. Like yeah. they wanted to meet in a Walmart parking lot. Oh and, like, yeah. Oh gosh, I hate this back here kind of breed. This guy wasn't doing it for money. He just he'd been doing it his whole life. He yeah. knew he knew the breed and uh, yeah, yeah. I just felt really comfortable with him. That's good. No, I mean it's a beautiful dog. Clearly he's a good breeder. Yeah, he, uh, very like big hunters though. So his prey drive is just like that's the on leash and prey drive is my my two biggest issues right now. Oh yeah. Other than that, he's great. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> well, good morning to you too. Yeah, a breeder, a breeder I got from, he, oh they really wanted him working if they could. Yeah. But um, yeah. I'm like, well, I'm not going to work him. He's going to be, I was going to maybe do some agility with him because I've done that with my other Vishlas, but mm. um, it just didn't stick with him. He's just too ADHD. Yeah. So, um, but he, uh, but yeah, most of the, 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 the hunting, you know, they wanted him hunting and stuff. Be yeah. He yeah, because he's got the really kind of more square face like Louie has. That's really not anything to pick up there, buddy. He's big. I mean, he's already tall. He's, that's about a, I mean, I don't think he'll get much, much bigger. Do you? I don't know. I mean, that's a, that's a pretty good looking, good sized Vishla. Yeah, we've been bigger than almost every dog Vishla we've met for a while now. Yeah, I, uh, this is I the can first that. time that I didn't even know if yours was a Vishla at first because I was like, wow, he's so big. <laughs> you know, he's so big. <laughs> leave it. I know, we, we uh, <laughs> leave it. <laughs> Yeah, his paws when he was a puppy, we when we saw him we're like, oh shit, yeah. we are in yeah. trouble. <laughs> so you're saying he's is he not good off leash other than like here? Oh he... no, he's he's terrible on leash. Oh yeah. He's okay. great on leash yeah, off yeah, leash. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, you know, he's seldom on a leash, so I get that. He's not yeah. great on it either. He'll he'll pull a little bit, and he's you know he's seven, and he's still. <laughs> but I I do the, I do the like the Gilman trail, and I oh, okay. Uh, I walk him. I mean, he's he's is getting older. I'm older. We do five miles every day religiously. I'll come here twice a week and just let him run it out. Yeah, yeah. But um, and I let him off the trail, so he'll like we'll all walk five miles. He'll you know he'll end up doing closer to probably seven because he'll run ahead and went back. Right. Back. Is it that's on the Burke Gilman? Yeah, well, sorry, the Kirkland Corridor. Oh, what's where's, where's so that? So it's at? um, 
in Kirkland. It goes from Woodenville to, it kind of hooks up with the, the Burke Gilman, but it goes from, it's the old train track. Um, if you haven't, you should run it. It's a beautiful run. And they can be off leash and be fine? Well, if you have good control. Oh, okay. Uh, it, you know, it's obviously everything is like, um, no, no dogs off leash. Oh yeah. But there's a path, it's an old train track. And then, um, there's a lot of area like this off to the side where he and I will walk off to the side. Oh, gotcha. Um, you should check, it's called the Kirkland Corridor Trail. And even just for one of your runs or something, if you see the lake almost the whole time. It's a beautiful, it's, it's high up. Where, where do you enter uh, to get there? Tons of places. Oh, okay. Just look it up online. I think, it, yeah, you're close. Am I? But. It's so deep. I know. I like the winters here much more. Oh yeah, we're, uh, you know, I, he already went once, so I'm wondering if it's just not enough to see. Yeah, that's probably what. <laughs> huh. Where are you from? Uh, I grew up in Kansas City, and then uh, I spent about 15 years in LA. Okay. And I, I moved up here right before the pandemic started. Okay. You like you say you like the weather better? Yeah. Oh, I love it here. This yeah. is like the best weather anywhere. Yeah, I love it too. I'm, I'm with you. Because Kansas is the worst weather on earth. Kansas, yeah. I've never, I mean, I've driven through Kansas. I'm from Salt Lake City originally. Oh, okay. Then I moved from there to sh when I was 23 to Chicago for 10 years. That's the horrible weather. Yeah, And extremes. then Dallas for 10 years. And I've been here for about 10 years. So... I think this is probably my favorite. It's kind of a good combination of everything. Yeah. And I uh, I prefer the winters and fall, so I'm really glad. I think we're going to have a short summer this year. Yeah, I'm with you. I, I like, I don't mind this overcast. Yeah, this is fine. Like even if the sun comes out, you know, a little bit, it's fine. But the overcast is nice. I can do a lot more. <laughs> well, the first two summers I was here, it was like the most extreme summers that Seattle's oh, yeah. had. We had some pretty, yeah. That I was, was like, this warm. is why I left LA. I yeah. don't know what to do yeah. with this. At least they're not that long. Yeah, it's just pretty much till Labor Day and then it's yeah. fine. Yeah. Mm. Are you going to Vishla Palooza? No. When's that? August 13th. Oh, in is it over at um, Snoqualmie? Is it in... Oh, it's in Snoqualmie. Okay. Yeah. I went, well, I, I, it was a different thing, but it was over at Sandpoint. Oh, no, I'll have to check that out. That could yeah. be fun. Yeah, there's like already, I think, 80 or 90 people RSVP. Oh, fun. I might have to check it out. Louie would love it. It's funny, he, he um, I've noticed this about him when we've been coming here, obviously, for, you know, six years or so. He, uh, he's attracted, like, he, he just identifies with the Vishla when he sees him. He'll, he'll go and he'll just run with him. Yeah. Like, yeah. other dogs will go up and sniff and stuff. But something, about, I don't know if they can tell that there's something there or what, but he... It's like another dog can keep up with me. Yeah, exactly, exactly. <laughs> yeah, his favorites are Vishlas and then like Huskies, Malamutes and Doodles are like, and Pugs. Yeah. And pugs, what? Pugs, he's like, he's oh. he's just like obsessed with Pugs. That is hilarious. Our two, be our best friend has two Pugs and he just, he play, he loves playing with the, the two Pugs. Yeah, just sniffs them and just sniffs follows them around. And he just gets down and he's like, yeah, oh, yeah. oh. <laughs> And her, my friend's pugs are younger, so they they can play with him for a minute and have yeah. fun. <laughs> for right, Does he get um, mosquito bites a lot when he's here? No, because we, we get he gets eaten alive. I've been going having really? to go to like uh, Edith Moulton Park. Oh. Because when we come here, we'll just go back, and he'll just get covered in mosquito bites. Oh wow. And I do too. That's why I dress like fully clothed because oh, I'll, wow. I'll get eaten alive too. Yeah, no, uh, that's interesting. I've never. I never like I, if that. he stands still, they immediately I can I can just start smacking them on him. Oh wow. Yeah. That's not. That's not and the ones here kind of sometimes look like they're from Jurassic Park. <laughs> they're big. Huge. Yeah, yeah. yeah. We're going out this <laughs> All right. way. I'll probably have to grab him because he'll okay. follow. Yeah, Lou, come on. We got to go get Timber, your nails. Timber, come here. Get your nails trimmed, bud. Come here, bud. Yeah, we're gonna do that too. <laughs> we'll get your come nails trimmed. Look. Hey. Okay. All right. Have a good one. All right, you two. What was your dog's name? Timber. Timber. This is Louie. Louie. What was your name? Uh, Clayton. Clayton. I'm Stormy. Stormy? Yeah. Sure. I'll see you here. Okay. Yeah. We'll later. see you around. <laughs> nice to meet you, Timber. Bye. All right.
and do a little leash training, bud. Okay, cool. Diversion. Yeah. A good place to run. All right, cool. Thanks. Oh wow. Something like that, so okay. I haven't done the whole thing, but I do a lot of it. Oh nice. Come on, let's go, bud. Good boy. Hey, sit. Sit. Can you sit down for me? Sit. Good boy. You didn't catch him, bud. You didn't catch him. You let him go. Yeah, <laughs> he's like a little deer. Is he a leash left? Yeah, yeah, he's almost nine months. Oh, yeah, you got a funny looking tail, don't you? <laughs> That's like the breed standard length, right? Uh, they, it's docked tail. Yeah. It would have been a lot longer, yeah. Yeah. But I guess they do it because it gets they get stuck in doors and stuff. I don't know. I know that. Yeah, I didn't really have an option. Yeah, I didn't with him either. The length of his tail is like too long for boxer standard. Oh yeah? So yeah, we joke around call it his finger. They're usually just like way shorter. <laughs> yeah. Good boy. How old's your dog? Uh he's six. Six? Yeah. Yeah. Nice. Still young at heart. Hi sweetie. Oh, you're just a love bug, aren't you? <laughs> I have some great ears. I would just like all day. <laughs> so soft. <laughs> yeah. Kind of a little bit of the the Dumbo element too. Oh yeah, it'll, <laughs> it'll fly away. <laughs> okay, okay, <come> on. <laughs> hey there. No. Nope. Not you. He's just shy. He's weird. Want some water? No. Okay. <laughs> you do. Yeah, I got tired of bringing like the actual bowl with another thing to pour it out of. I'm gonna save some. Ready to go swim, buddy?